Welcome to day five of Randall Vlogs. So, recently, this is going to be just like a little story time for today. So, what I was going to think. So, recently, because I, I got an outdated phone, right? I still got the, the XR, you know? Everybody else got like a 12, 13, even a 15, all that. I be wanting to get that, but then again, bro, they be, I don't know, bro, they be trying to tax too much on that, bro. I be wanting to just, I do need a new phone, but I'm going to wait. I don't know if I want to get a new phone and I get paid or not. Because right now, I'm trying to save up because I got the sauce on one of my music and vlogs. I just got to make sure I got a decent amount of bread saved up. So this motherfucker, this XR, I had this bit for like four years. This motherfucker be going in and out whenever somebody called me. I got to cut it off. Ugh, I got to cut it off, cut it back on and all that, bro. Just so I can hear somebody, bro. I don't, it's when I, sometimes it be happening when I be answering on my iPad. Like... I don't know why I do that when I'm trying to answer my iPad, because, bro, not all the time when I be on my iPad, I'm trying to have my phone, you know? And then, I got to also try to put some bread to the side so I can go get my teeth pulled out. I got I to gotta buy, yeah, I got to get my teeth, so get my teeth pulled out, because I need two more wisdom teeth pulled out. So I can get some braces. But I'm not getting, you know, the regular braces. It's just the Invisalign with that. And I got to keep it in my mouth longer. But they was say, like, you could either do the keep them in at night or keep them in all day. So I'd rather do the one all day and just take them out whenever I'm eating. And then just put them back and clean my mouth. And then put them uh, back in. Because I ain't gonna lie to you, I've been needing braces since I was a shorty, and I've been insecure about that for the longest. <clears throat> I just woke up too, though, so that's the reason why I ain't really trying to uh, low key get up and all that, bro. I'm still tired, bro. It's I think I what time is it? It's only nine. It's only nine o'clock, bro. So you know what that means? It's early. I got work tomorrow. I get paid this week though, but and I got my head done, so this fro won't be in my head. I won't have this fro. I low key don't like when I wear a fro because it's like every time, each one I'm trying to take care of my afro, so it don't be bogus on that having clumps of hair. Just like clumps of hair always keep falling out, even when I'm taking care of it. That's the only reason why I hate taking down my hair. Like, I was supposed to get my head done, like, probably, like, two weeks ago for my sibling. She act like she ain't want to do it. That's what I'm like. That's all good, bro. Because, like I said, I'm not mad at her no more. But, like I told her, my other siblings, my mom, like, bro, she go ask for something. She go, bro, whatever that fly or moth, whatever that was. She go ask me for something. Say, like, oh, ooh, can I get this and that? Or can you buy me this now? Or give me... A ride, woo, like, bro, nope. That's what type of time I could have been on, or I can be on, but I don't really count this much, bro. It is what it is, like I was saying. Uh, I got the bread to get my hair done, get my hair cut, pay off some of these bills, and then keep grinding, because I don't know if I want to wait, because, damn, what's the, oh, the state fair coming up. I can vlog the state fair. Because like I said, I'm doing 90 vlog, 90 day challenge to see what growth I can get. Get the state fair. All type of shit. Like, bro, it's so bad, my T, bro. That's the only thing I really hate. I got, like, I'm not, I might troll and say I'm like ugly and this and that. Because I'm not one of them niggas that be like, oh, I'm the best looking. Nah, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm cool, you know? Some people think I'm attractive, some people I don't. 
No, I ain't one of them niggas that's like that. They be giving sex line th- vibes. They be trying to act like they. Oh, bro, I'm telling you, I don't be doing that colorism because a uh, uh, couple of people see him, but certain people that's like a certain skin color that's black, they be acting more, they be acting more fruity than, you know, the stereotypes on the uh, skin colors, you know? Thankfully, I'm on the karma skin side. I might look like, but I'm karma skin game, you know? So I don't want y'all, yo, boy, you like, boy, no. I'm karma game. I'm just like at the beginning of the little karma, you know? Like the little, still on the edge of the, yeah, but I'm karma, you know? But I don't know, bro. Like, I'm going to try to get a vlog of me at work, but I'm most likely going to have to mute. Mute the what's it called? Mute, the, mute it and just do a voiceover on it because you know how this is, they going to be playing music. So, And I'm going to show y'all what I'll be doing at work. And also, let me see, because I'm just, this ain't going to be nothing but me just, this vlog is me just yapping and running my mouth game. And let me see what else I'm trying to think of. Bro, I'm trying to see. Because I do want a PC, but then again, like, bro, if I buy that, bro, I'm just trying to think, like, man. Because I need a better lighting in my crib, bro. It's like, I don't know how much this going to cost. So I'll ask them how much it costs to get this crap fixed in my, my room because the light... When only one of the lights on, and then the other side is dark. Then my closet door broke, kind of like, bro. I can't wait, bro, to I move to Arizona, bro. Like, bro, I'm ready to leave Minnesota so bad. Come on, bro. Loopy flower, whatever that is, mosquito keep getting in my face. But I'm ready to leave this state, bro. I've been here since 2021. Because, like I said, Technically, we didn't really move out here to 2021. The end of 2020, like, I was just, they were basically, like, we trying to get the feel of Minnesota because we was going back and forth at the end around, like, Thanksgiving and Christmas and all that. We was just basically trying to see how it feel to be out here. Oh, well, actually, Halloween first. Because so I came out here for, like, a couple of days, and I went back to the city. I'm like, I don't know. I'm like, it's decent. It's quiet, you know? It's better than Chicago, you know, because no, that's the only good thing. Like, I ain't got a really, because I was living, I'm still living in the hood, but compared to him, compared to Chicago hoods, bro, I had to, I'm literally living in the middle of a war zone, so cause that's where my pops and them grew up, my, my pops and my uh, step pops grew up, and they all, like, we was living, like, on. Before we moved on more, we was on, because we was on, uh, we moved around a lot around when we was growing up, but we was still mostly in Chicago, because we went from the low end to, like, Inglewood to uh, Motown. But when we moved from off Hermitage to uh, to Sangman, we wasn't even in there probably, like, um, we was probably over there for, like, a month, really. By the time it was around for school-wise, we ended up moving right on Morgan into that little basement because she had the crib we was living in. My grandma old crib before they got to take him on. My pops, my uncle, they, they got that bit took. So our granny crib grown just like my mama, uh, like my OG mama uh crib. They took her building there off Morgan. So like both our grand, so both my granny's crib gone that one passed away. So I'm like, damn, bro. I wish we, our grandma Pat building her still there because we could have been in there instead of being in that basement. I don't know my mama would have figured something out to get us in that building. We could have had that bitch. It was like, because my grandma and her uh, roommate was sharing that building. It was like, uh, her roommate was upstairs of the building and my grandma was at the bottom half. And I don't think it had no basement. I think it was just like two floors, but... It was still a big building. That's what, that's all I was trying to say. Like, it was a, still a big building. And I'm like, bro, they tore down my grandma building, bro. I was over blue. And then we moved, like I said, we moved on Morgan into uh, 
my aunt, my great aunt, uh, Bill's hand. It was bad. It's low key like how it is over here, bro. Like, cause me, I don't really care about sharing my business. Like, it's the same thing going on. It's just we got better. It's better compared to that. We got more space, isn't that? But we still got to worry about mice, bro, because how these buildings is, they making a the hood. They don't really be caring. They be leaving cracks and shit. And then we live in like an apartment comp, well, not a complex. It's like apartment houses. And it's like two houses connected together. Well, actually more because it's like two in the front and then one in the back. So, no people are friend of this building is dirty, bro. So, no matter what, because we bought hella mice tra traps. I bought caulk to tighten up all this shit. Still saying mice run through this bitch, no matter how much we clean up this and that. Like, bro, people is dirty, bro. They steal clothes. They stole, like, three, four pair of my jeans. Like, bro, people is dirty, bro. Like, instead of just getting your money... Bro, my lip, my top lip looks way, looks swollen, bro. I know I'm not tweaking, but my top lip looks swollen. But yeah, like bro, people stole jeans. I'm talking like y'all go get get y'all own money. I don't care how you get money, just go get you some money and buy y'all own shit. Stealing other people's shit is dirty works, bro. Like y'all is bombs for doing that. <clears throat> I don't like doing that because, like, bro, you could do anything in the world, but you want to steal people's mail, bro, packages. Like, y'all is some bums, bro. Uh, when I leave, bro, and then hopefully around that time when I do move out of Minnesota, my OG and them get a better crib somewhere in, like, a good part of Minnesota. Because they probably, because how it is, it's like, it's good parts in Minneapolis. I don't know if they're going to stay over here. Or oh, go to a different city. Whatever they do, hopefully they go somewhere that's good, good area. They ain't got worries about too much. But I yeah, could get a, to a better school, this and that. Cause like, bro, it ain't. You know, he could probably have way more opportunities to do some other stuff than just being in this dirty ass back backyard. No, well, we ain't even a backyard. It's basically like a parking lot. Cause it ain't nothing but concrete back right there and trash. And we just put garbage cans back right there, bro. It's like I'm trying to grind, bro. Cause I wish I was working on job that was paying every week, like a band a week. Cause then that would have been good, but I ain't really tripping, bro. When I'm getting I just got a raise with this warehouse I'm working at. I'm getting paid every two weeks, which is over a band, but like I said, I wish it was over a bit. If I was getting paid, how much I'm getting paid every two weeks, every week, bro, I promise you, we would, I would have been on the road to literally, I was been like, by the time it hit winter time, I was going to apply for the crib out in Arizona. I know I was going to secure it. Get me and my sister, because me and my little sister moving out there. It's like my youngest sister. Because my little brother finna move to, uh, I said move, my little brother finna go to college. It's like me and my little sister. I'm trying to convince my other sister to come out there, but I don't know. It's maybe by the time when I move out there, hopefully I can convince them. Try to talk to the person that I get the crib from. Try to get them a crib on the same block as me. Or like a block over, a block like behind or over in front. So we can all be just... Grow up so they can raise their kids somewhere else. Minnesota ain't it for growing up. Growing up ah, raising children, bro. It ain't shit out here, bro. Like, real deal. Everything be far as hell. We ain't got V's either. Like, most of us got you no know, other job. Only one person got their L's. Like, that's why I gotta work on. I gotta work on. Because it's different states compared to Illinois and Minnesota is different. Like, Chicago, you can go up there and get your L's. Like, I really wish I would have, you know, I wasn't listening to my OG at like certain times being a hard head motherfucker. Excuse my language, but I should have ain't listened to around that time about getting my L's and just went up there, did it, got some, saved up some of the little bread I was getting from the upper bound and all that. 
and I would have went to go get my L's, and I could have had my shit. And I was been working driving jobs. I could have got me a CDL, ran that shit up, and I would have been blew, blew up on YouTube, blog, on the streaming, music, all that, bro. Like, everything don't happen how you think it, you know? Now I'm on the long route. All I can say is I'm happy I got my Google Ads account back. Now I can, like I said, save up to invest into promote my video so it can get reach a bigger audience. And once I be able to start doing that, it's gonna be crazy. I'm gonna I'm gonna vlog me going to get my uh passport because it's I've been bullshitting for so many years. I gotta get it ASAP so I could be up. Cause I want to go to Japan, folks. Like I said, I'm a person that like traveling, trying new shit. This and that, and I want y'all to follow my journey growing from right now. I'm at 90 subscribers on this one on my vlog channel. I'm trying to blow up this channel and my uh, my music channel. My music channel almost at 2k, it's been there for a bit. <coughs> Excuse me, <clears throat> I'm trying to grow both of them. With the music side, though, I'm gonna have to do like I do with the mu with the vlog. I'm gonna have to. I can't promote as that much on the music. I gotta promote one song at a time. Same thing with the vlog. Promote one video at a time to hit a decent route. Oh my goodness! Oh, excuse me, man. <laughs> I'm just still trying to get over this last stage of this sickness. It's like. I still got mucus stuck, like, right here. And then it's, like, stuck in my nose. I'm trying to get it officially out so I can be good. That's why I've been, because they be like, don't take sh hot showers in the summer. Only reason why I'm doing it because I need to sweat this shit out so it can come out and I can be clear, bro. I sound better compared to the first time, but I'm still got this little ickness. And I don't know, I'm trying to get it out, bro. Well, like I was saying about my music and vlog, like, I got to promote one from each channel, like, blow that bitch up, this and that, keep going, keep streaming. Streaming-wise, it's like, I be trying to get clips, but only play the same game. I don't be one to just play Warzone, but I can't, well, I can't, I can't say I can't. I have to get more games, and I'm a, a story, a, a story, uh, campaign game. I like to play stuff that you just do multiple things and start just... Doing the same old same. I like to do all type of shit. I like scary games, adventure games, all type of games. Like any games, man, I just like to play. Like, don't get me wrong. I like competitive games when it's like teams and all that. But I like to have fun and do stuff on my own, you know? But this is my yapping session. <clears throat> We go get this camera. We go get this laptop. I'm gonna do better thumbnails, and I'm gonna do I don't know, and better, better, some, better everything, bro. I'm gonna just be. I'm gonna get me a real intro, outro, all that. Cause how about it, this? need to get out of me <clears throat> out of me ASAP but yeah bro and you see it with the light one piece and then the other is dark so you see one side dark and one light because of this goofy stuff but yeah bro cause I really can't vlog that long cause my phone then iPad be told so I run out of storage this and that and I literally paid for hella storage and all that crap so I don't really get annoyed with that that's why I gotta give me a camera, a new phone, and then we finna get active, bro. But yeah, man, tomorrow, cause I got work, I'm trying to get some little, little clips or something of me at work, showing y'all that I'm working on. Uh, if I'm working on the couches, cause tomorrow Monday, it gonna be a lot of people. I don't really like working on complex, but if I'm working on complex, I'll show y'all like that. If not. I see uh, if I'm doing like simple inspections or like getting stuff off the truck and all that, 
If I'm getting stuff off the truck, I probably ain't gonna really get to because I can't hold it and then show y'all like this and that. So I'll probably just wait until like I'll do like simple inspections or like or if I'm on trash, then I'll show y'all like I ain't really doing nothing but just bringing grabbing trash and all that, sweeping up the warehouse and all that crap, you know. But I just woke up, started my day game, see the bonnet on. Probably don't even take that bit off, honestly. I don't feel like it. I'm most like I am, but I don't really like taking it off because cause it is from like I'm really tired of bothering this shit. I got six days until I get my hair done, so gotta thug it out. It's almost a couple more days till I get paid. Yeah, yeah, man. I stopped, I ain't gonna lie. I, you know, it's, it's another thing I forgot to tell him, but stop working two days at Target Field because now they trying to make every Saturday's uh, afternoon game. I liked when it's morning, the Saturdays and Sunday game morning, because, bro, it's better. Because now you got your afternoon for whatever you want to do. But people complain to them, well, I don't like coming on Saturdays or the morning. Like, bro. Y'all be complaining about the easiest money, folks. The shit is easy, gang. I'm gonna have to get a vlog of me at Target Field, too. So, probably, like, because I got, I got my head done. I ain't gonna be able to record me getting my head done. I'll probably get y'all, like, little stunts, like, after my head done, my hair cut, and me just chilling and all that. And we'll just have a little, you know, the yap session and shit, you know? But, yeah, man. I'm going to show y'all some of the other stuff I be doing. One of these days, we just going to be literally just at the park. Just vibing. Well, not a park. Uh, one of them lakes. And we just walk in, just vibing. I'll show y'all how it is. Because Minnesota got hella lakes. And they be just vibe sometimes. Just to chill and all that other stuff, you know? But this is day five. It seems, I, don't, I be forgetting, I be thinking, like, it's the other days. I'm like, today, I was tweaking to them day two, day three. Yeah, but this the only one I'm going to actually have, like, a be able to see this to end in the right way because the last couple of vlogs have been ending because they told me I ain't got storage and this and that. But I see y'all boys. I'm not going to say just boys because I'll probably get, I don't want just one type of uh, category of viewerships. I want. Both genders, men and men, girls and boys, men and women, you know? I don't want just male and female. I might literally put it like that. Male and female. I don't just want one John to watch me. I like, I want everybody to watch me. Bro, we all see, y'all go see the growth from 90 subscribers to 100, 100 to 1,000, 1,000 to 10,000, 10,000 to 100,000, 100,000 to 500,000, 500,000 to 750,000, 750,000 to an M, and keep going. Same thing with the music. It's like, y'all go see me grow, bro. I'm telling you, once I be able to add the little right clips how I used to do, add clips of my music in the beginning and the end, and y'all say, whoa, what's that song? This and that, whoa, go check out my main, my uh, my music chat, channel, Solo T, Chase the Bag, go on that. I'm like linking a bio to that channel and listen to that song, you know? But all right, y'all, bro. I ain't finna do nothing but just chill on this Sunday. I'm thankful. Be grateful that you seen it woke up another 24. Be grateful that God chose you to see another day because some people don't get to see another day. And they could have, you know, passed away in their sleep or something happened. Just be thankful. Try to... Stop. Don't be like me sometimes, because sometimes I break down. I know I'm human this name, and I can bottle up all my feelings. But you got to just thank him, just grind, and just understand, like, everything. Everything ain't about you, bro. It's people that's in way worse than situations. Just be grateful, thankful, and just keep chasing your dreams and goals, bro. And you will see some, uh, see some uh, changes in your life. It might not happen right now. It might not happen tomorrow. It might not happen next week. But the next couple of months, you will see that you went from this, from right there, to up there living lavish. And that's going to be me. I'm thinking with that small mask, I think like, oh, these rappers blowing up this and that, and I'm still ain't blew up. 
Now, all them rappers, especially that's doing drill, last that long. All them getting booked and stuff. It's like, I do different type of music from being in Chicago. I ain't talking about sliding, killing nobody, this and that. I got some songs that say that, but um, that's not my main priority. I got other type of music. I'm low-key one of the ones that like, because I like getting money type of music. That's that Detroit sound. Then niggas talking about getting money. I don't really care too much about killing this now. I, now, look, I ain't say I ain't got that in my playlist, but like, bro, every day listening about killing somebody, that ain't good for your head. But, you know, I can't tell nobody what to do. They they own self. That's what Chicago is. They don't really care about good music. They just be want to hear somebody slide this and that dance. They RFP to everybody. But, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever, bro. Once on our blood, I don't want people on my deck. I don't want people talking to me like, oh, I'm this and that. I remember I was just supporting. Oh, no, yeah, I wasn't, bro. Y'all was the same ones whenever I post links. The stuff saying click this, watch this, y'all don't do it. But when y'all see other people that's famous or something, y'all go click to do this and that. It's all good, bro. Once when I get to that level where I'm famous from vlogging, from YouTube, and making music and streaming, I promise you, bro, to all my long, all my people that passed away, bro, I won't be talking to none of y'all. And I don't want people from the past. Come and tell me, tell me, oh, this and that, call my phone, this and that. Stay y'all us. Y'all wait, bro. I'm game. I love y'all. See y'all on the next vlog tomorrow.